So right guys, before this video begins, I do have a few quick things to say. So guys, I actually am doing a QA and a for my 10k sub special, so I will leave a little link to the tweet down in the description below. If you guys do want to ask me a few questions, all you have to do is reply to that tweet. And before this video begins, it would be really cool if you guys could go down there and leave a like as well for some more BYD. And I hope you guys do enjoy this video, and peace. Yo, what is up guys, Shotgun here, and welcome back to another video. So today, you guys, we are back on BYD for another episode, and as you guys can see around me, we're actually in a, I guess what somewhat looks like a faction base, so guys, I actually did a lot of off-screen grinding, because I haven't done one of these episodes in a while, and I was like, yo, I can't really come back, and I guess just stay a pleb, because I've only done one episode, and I guess we actually obtained a lot of diamonds in that episode, as you guys can see, I have an armor set on as well, but we definitely do need to work that armor set up to P4, so we can't actually try and PvP people. So yeah, I really did have to do some off-screen grinding to catch up to everyone else, because this is actually only my second episode, and I guess everyone else has been working on this stuff for a little while, so... As you guys can see, I spent so freaking long gathering all the obby, I had to freaking mine it up with like normal pickaxe and then I guess I had to grind out for at least 2 hours to freaking make an efficiency for one because there's literally no spawn grinders on this server, I guess there are a few but I actually got TP to one and then I grinded a bit there and then I fell, I guess I fell off the end, I ended up dying so that really wasn't good, I ended up losing all my levels and stuff there and then I guess after that we actually had to start from zero and try work ourselves up from I guess coal, so I was actually out mining coal, I'll actually show you guys where I actually got most of this stuff from. So as you guys can see here, this is actually my town. If I actually head straight down over here, there is a cave down here. Please don't blow up. And by the way, if these guys do blow up, I'll just quickly show you because I didn't actually know this before. So if I let these guys blow up on me, Okay, there you go. Now we just wait a little bit. And I think these guys do gen back in automatically, which is kind of dope. I think this works for everyone on all towny claims. So if we just wait for it to come back. Oh my god, this is actually so dumb. If it doesn't come back and I just kind of left a hole there. Alright, it's not genning back. Uh, we'll come back to that later. Hopefully it is actually patched by the time I come. Yeah, there you go. I think, you, yeah, you guys just saw it there. If you noticed it from, like, the corner of the screen. It actually did just patch up right there. You guys will see it when we run back around. But here you go anyway. So, if I actually run all the way down over here, there's actually a little cave system. So, if I just jump straight down... And where is it? Yeah, straight down here. So I'm just going to eat this up as well. And I actually think I just saw a freaking name tag somewhere around here. I'm not even joking. I swear I just saw a name tag. So our town is obviously, I guess, in first place players every now and again because Mitch is on it. And I guess people actually camp outside our town for us to jump out and then for everyone else to jump on us. So I actually am kind of scared if someone does end up popping out on us. But guys, if you actually come all the way down over here, as you guys can see, there is a little system down here. So if I just run straight, I actually did manage to pick up all the obby and whatnot so right here is where i was mining most of the obsidian and obviously there is still some lava over here i just quickly do that just so i can make it obby again so this is actually where i was collecting most of the obby i was just turning it back in and out and i guess also had a bit of help so yeah there is another guy on the server by the name of Lipa and our friend shane's hugs who's actually in the town here as well so Lipa actually hooked me up with a bit of obby and he hooked me up with a bit of bow to buy some obby shame same with shane's hugs so just want to say thanks to them for actually helping me make the base so i actually just head back to t-spawn that's actually where i went to actually get the materials and everything for this base and by the way guys it actually is really early in the morning so if my voice seems kind of dead to you guys and i guess it really is kind of dead even to me just because <laughs> i literally just woke up like two hours ago and i guess i really didn't drink too much water which i probably should have so yeah that kind of explains the creaky voice or whatnot but yeah, here is the base actually guys so I don't know why I made it like this, but literally I can't build, so as a factions player, this is not my first, like, the first thing that popped in my head was to make an actual base, so if there was more space, I actually would have set down some region walls, maybe even put some walls down outside of those region walls, and maybe even put some corner pillars and whatnot, and I actually would have actually expanded this base all the way up down to bedrock as well, if it didn't cost too much, but yeah, there's not enough space, and I guess on this server, obby costs a lot of money, and I guess if I do slash warp GE, which is the global exchange, I do believe, which was just added to the server, you guys can actually go ahead head head here and you can actually buy yourself some obby so yeah guys now i'm actually back in the base so i actually do need to actually grind myself up some more exp but the thing is this elytra is so buggy by the way i don't know why it's not working out for me so if i actually just go back to slash t spawn i actually was really grinding out outside the thing and i guess i really i guess i have 27 levels on me so i really just need three more levels so i was grinding out outside over here next to the mobs but obviously every now and again some people actually pop up right behind me and they start cheating their hits down me nobody's managed to kill me just yet doing that but it's only a matter of time before someone actually tries and kills me and actually gets away with it so it's gonna be really risky what i'm doing over here just because i know there's so many people like right now there's not too many people around but usually 
there's like a whole crap ton of people that pop up all the way around here so as you guys can see when i step into my little town it says P no pvp so if i actually try to enable that in a little bit i don't do it just yet actually if i try to enable it though people can't actually step into my little thing and try fighting me so now i'm actually back in the base i'm actually not going to do what i was originally planning to do but for now i actually do think i should probably set myself up here farm because we're only into the second episode so i don't think i really need to rush the whole trap scene just yet i definitely will try and do that sometime soon so i just go ahead and make a shovel and i already had one in there nice so now i need to make myself a diamond hose if i actually just go ahead and just do this there is and there isn't so nice i need to make i need to find myself some freaking sticks oh my god did do not even have sticks or anything so yeah i have dirt here as well so i just quickly go ahead and set it up somewhere around here so honestly i'm not too sure where exactly i want to put this because if i put it over here it's not really going to look too nice and it's going to take up a lot of space so really have no clue how exactly i want to set this up if i take the cobblestone out as well maybe i can do it. yeah actually right now it doesn't matter too much once i get some obby i'll actually go ahead and replace this so maybe i can set up a little area up here where i can put all of the all of like the farms and stuff down on so if i actually just go ahead and do this maybe i should bring it one down. actually now nah, if i bring you another one down it's gonna kind of look a bit too close to my head over here so I'm just going to go ahead and do this, keep bringing this guy out, and this is actually getting annoying. So if I just go up over here like this, I honestly don't have fly or anything. This isn't like me literally playing factions right now, so I can't fly or anything. So let's actually go ahead and just do this. Yeah, this is so much smoother and faster. Let's go ahead and keep placing these guys out. And by the way, I didn't actually time lapse any of my off-screen grinding just because I didn't really think it'd be too entertaining to watch. And oh my god, I don't really think I have enough. And I honestly don't even have enough. Nice. So I need to quickly take this pickaxe out and mine these guys up. Honestly, I don't think I have enough to actually do this guy. Oh, no, nah, that's actually bad. So I actually just go ahead and pull up over there. I didn't even pick up all the cobblestone, but I really still do not have enough. So it's actually just going to do that. Mine this guy up once again. And honestly... My voice is somewhat dead right now, as you guys can probably hear. So yeah, honestly, I don't even have too much left there. So if I just quickly go ahead and slash T space spawn it, I actually need to go ahead and grab myself out some more cobblestone. So obviously, I'm going to head straight into the little traditional mine we have over there. Honestly, once this episode goes up, I do believe I probably won't be heading back in here just because I know you guys are probably going to be in here. And I've seen a lot of people follow me around here, but I don't let anybody actually follow me into this mine. And I also ran out of food just there, so that honestly isn't good either. Yeah, I really did run out of food. Only have brought flesh on me obviously i can't eat that but i don't want to eat that so actually it's going to head straight down so my regen is now gone as well so this isn't good so if i actually take full damage here i'm actually not going to be regening it unless i eat up my gapple so i actually go ahead and just do that and actually start mining this up right here all right there you go so we've been mining this up for a little bit now honestly i don't think i need too much more but i'm going to carry on mining it just because i don't really want to come back here later because i know you guys are going to come down here and probably wait for me or something so honestly isn't the best idea actually showing this mine off in the video because from past experiences when i show stuff like this off there's always that one guy who comes comes there and actually not just comes there but there's always that one guy who has to do something stupid so I guess I don't really want to come back down here and I guess there is also a lot of stuff here so yeah now I'm legit out of food which is not bad at all I'm actually not bad at all which is really bad so I really do need to set this one thing up over here so I have a small idea which honestly isn't too small but it will work out just for now so if I actually go ahead and just burn meal this guy burn meal again mine it up and then just keep rinse and repeating that I actually can just instantly make myself some whoops what the hell happened there so if i just keep repeating this i guess i can make myself one piece of freaking bread and that one bread will be enough to feed my whole family uh we've got three so i can make one with that but i still won't have enough to actually okay this is bad oh wait actually i've got a small idea i'm stupid so actually just quickly mine that up i should probably hoe out the whole area over here as well while i'm at it so if I actually do it like this, but the thing is, I'm actually going to have to waste out all my bone meal by doing this. That honestly isn't too good, but I guess we're going to have to deal with it for now. So if I actually go ahead and just set all of these guys... Wait, what? Wait, what's going on over there? Why didn't it go down? Oh yeah, I don't really have the water source properly. Okay, yeah, I see. Alright, that's not too good at all. If I just go outside the base and chuck an ender pot up in the sky and land on top of the base, I actually can go ahead and just pick up some of the water over here. Because obviously, there is an infinite source up here and I can only set one home as well, which is really bad. So every time I leave this area, and whoops, that's like the wrong hole to dig that one out from. And I'm going to leak some water on myself. Nice. So if I actually just go ahead and pull up through here, please land properly. And there you go. So I'm just going to mine up through here. Where exactly did I mine that hole? It's right there. 
So what exactly I really want to do right now is I didn't actually get myself any more depth. There we go. My hearts are literally disappearing right now as I come back up here. Just pick up a bit more of the water so I can finish the insides off. So if I just go to mine this up and place mine in the right spot. Not the right spot over there. This is such a small base as well which is so bad. But the plot is so small that I'm kind of limited really badly on what I can and can't do. So there goes my final end of hole and I actually didn't die right there. I don't know how I just gen half a heart right there. Honestly no clue but... It's actually going to just come up over here, put this guy down, and that should be infinite. Okay, there you go. So now we have an infinite water source running all the way through here as well. So if I just test it out, so there you go, then it is actually infinite. So if I just actually put all of these guys down like this, and for some reason it keeps popping out when I put them next to each other, which is kind of weird. Honestly, no clue what is going on over there. I think I'm doing something wrong, but honestly, I don't freaking play survival Minecraft, so I have no clue what exactly it should be doing. And I just did it there again, so I have no clue why it's doing that right now, but honestly, right now I do need to focus on describing as much food as i possibly can so if i just go ahead and just burn me up these guys once again there you go one two one two i guess i am really wasting out the burn meal by doing this as well but honestly i really need this food right now because as you guys can see i have four hunger bars and if i do slash kit steak as you guys can see as well one hour and three minutes so honestly i can't wait that long because i'm probably gonna be dead by the time that happens so i really do need to focus on getting this food up one two one two and one two what happens if i do on that okay i can't i was about to say what happens if i do if there's nothing even there i literally am such a nub i just survive minecraft but to be honest if i just carry over what i really know from factions and whatnot I honestly really isn't too hard uh that just popped out and it's popping out so as soon as i place something on this side it starts popping out again for some reason which is really weird so I don't think it's meant to do that. If I just put that there and put this one over here and like that. Yeah, that seems to work. So honestly, no clue why it's popping out. Probably won't set anything down for the night until I figure out what actually is going on over here. So if I actually, let's see. We've got 16 right now. So ooh, how exactly do I want to make a little thing to get back up here? Should I set up a little ladder system over here? Maybe that would be the smartest idea. So I do have it on me as well. So if I go over here and I guess make a crap ton of sticks to make myself this ladder. So there you go. Then we can make ourselves six ladders. If I actually just go and find it. Okay, it's right there. Do this. And I guess we are pretty much good then. So, oh my god. This is such a rookie thing to do. I don't know why I'm making it like this. But it is whatever. So if I actually just go ahead and just keep setting these guys back down. I probably should have actually made myself some bread while I was like down there. But honestly, whatever. One chew, one chew, and one chew. And there you go. Now we're actually making some freaking progress towards some food and i think honestly no clue at all why it's happening like this i don't know why it keeps popping out of the ground and i put them next to each other does it have something to do with that one cobblestone i placed down honestly no clue at all so if i just go ahead and do this make myself five bread there you go this honestly isn't going to last me very long but if i can set up a little thing make this farm big enough and i guess it's pretty much should be good to be doing this quite often so it's actually going to pick up all the rest of it we've got four more so i can make one more bread but really realistically i don't really need just one more bread i really need to try and mass produce these guys so if i actually just go and place them down once again actually i'm just gonna make a few more before i actually stop doing this because right now food is like my biggest concern even off camera i was freaking trying to grind with no food i was being attacked by mobs and everything while i was trying to get my 30 levels for my efficiency for pickaxe so i could mine the obby and really it literally wasn't working out for me it was absolutely horrible so i really do need to set myself up with a stable little source for food which is exactly what i'm doing right now and there you go we're basically out right now so if i just go ahead and set i guess we should just set a little thing up over here as well i do need to put some light down as well so these guys grow properly so let's go and just put that guy over there so now i need to make some torches so do i have any coal i have lots of coal actually and i have this over here so if i just do this put it down over here like so make myself four torches that should be good next i can just lay up the area over here yeah that's good okay yeah that's actually really good but hmm, actually wait did i just trample it please no i didn't trample it I think I'm gonna actually spam some more torches down maybe because I wanna absolutely light the hell out of this place just cause wait does it work now? If I place it oh it's working. Oh so it actually was just the light. Okay, yeah, I understand how that okay, I don't really but I honestly have no clue why it works with the light, but there you go, now it is working because of the light, so no clue why exactly the light makes it work like that, but I guess it does. If I just head over here and mine up one little thing over here, just stash home, head back up. And I guess I can just put, by, put down my final piece over here. So just mine this guy up, put this guy down, and bang. So there you go. 
now we really have a full source over here so it looks like we really did make a lot of progress in like this past few days because honestly i've done most of this off camera but this was actually kind of dope and the fact that i actually gained a lot of stuff as well so in that first episode with the little i guess i still need to figure out how the elytra works so it's really bugging out for me i have no clue why even on top of the base it doesn't work out properly so yeah as you guys can see over here we have diamonds and i have this sick bow as well i don't know why i'm not using that i don't really want that to get lost but that freaking bow that's op as well but apart from that we have some diamonds over here so if we didn't get that in the first episode we actually wouldn't have even been able to make this thing over here i needed that armor to actually go in and make the diamond pickaxe and everything and i guess to get the obby so we got really lucky in that first episode to actually have i guess got that really nice start with the little vault we found so guys i think i will actually wrap this video up here before my voice completely gives out because as you guys can hear my voice is almost dead i'm literally talking too much and not drinking enough water so i think i will actually just go ahead and wrap this video up here so if you guys did enjoy today's episode of byd be sure to leave a like be sure to actually shoot me a few questions from the tweet in the description below i'll see you guys next time peace out everyone